News in the world of Valheim. Let's go. So Ashlands is out and everybody is burning up. Let's look at the first patch. Iron Gate has gotten a lot of feedback and they already have some tweaks for us. One of the main issues was the new ship getting stuck against the giant rocks. And so they've worked on that. And also a main thing that people uh, had an issue with was portals not connecting properly. And so that should be taken care of. Also, your cooking station catching on fire. Um, yeah, that would be a problem. I know wood catches on fire, but mm, need to cook. Also, and I think this one will be largely appreciated, though a few people that are hardcore may not like it. <laughs> we have also hopefully solved the issue where you would be far too overwhelmed by enemies when you land in the Ashlands. This is real. So it turns out the enemies were getting drawn to you whenever you stood near a tree. And there are oh, quite a few burn trees in the area. Or if a tree was taking damage from a fire caused by cinders. So now enemies should only react to the sound of falling trees and the sound from when you or enemies are damaging the environment and not the fire from the cinders that's happening everywhere. So no, they're not saying that they're nerfing the enemies right now. I know a lot of people are, or at least some people are really worried about that. But hopefully you won't get swarmed as much by all of them at one time. So the details of the patch notes. Fix an issue which could cause the Drakkar ship to get stuck. Especially they're talking about on rocks in the ocean. Fix the balancing issue that could attract too many nearby en enemies because of the trees catching fire. Charred warriors no longer spawn under the sea. I'm sure they can still walk into the ocean, but they're not going to spawn underneath your, your boat. Balancing tweaks to some of Fader's attacks. Portals should no longer have a problem reconnecting after changing name. Tweak Collider to prevent rugs from clipping into the Grostan floor pieces. I mean, it made for an interesting grout, but I don't think that was really a purpose. Ashwood walls with 26 and 45 degree angle now align better with the other Ashwood wall pieces. That's nice. Cooking stations can no longer catch on fire. Building pieces will no longer start burning before being placed. Recipes for multiple armors and weapons in Ashlands has been updated to use the correct workbench levels. Summoned trolls now have a small chance to spawn cinders. Summoned trolls are now immune to fire damage. Some visual tweaks to Dernwin. Visual tweaks to bone fragments. Tweaks to the Ashen Cape visual behavior. It was acting funny or looking funny. Corrected missing text strings. Compiler optimizations for Xbox. Sulfur now makes correct sound when picked up. Fixed a performance issue related to many damage numbers. Fixed an issue causing the downloan size to be unnecessarily large. That's always good. Modding. iMono updater no longer requires to be inherited from and error messages removes. removed. These all seem like good updates to me. Ashlands is intense and exciting and we want it to be the most amazing. So if you're doing public tests, make sure you keep on reporting those bugs and giving them feedback. Until next time. Happy gaming.